These are some of the pictures on the ground painting the grim situation in Marsabit County as a result of the prolonged drought. A number of livestock have died with families getting none or just little to eat due to hunger pangs. Piped water and water pans too have dried up. According to the government, Marsabit County is among the 12 counties facing severe risk of drought as it continues to bite. Baringo County, Garissa, Isiolo, Kilifi, Kitui, Lamu, Mandera, Samburu, Tana River, Turkana and Wajia are also in the list. The government spokesperson, Colonel Richard Cyrus Oguna, says the government has released 2 billion shillings to Marsabit, Mandera, Turkana and Wajia counties to cushion those suffering with drought under the safety net program since July last year. However, the situation seems to be getting worse among a number of residents in targeted counties. The government further says that it has been cushioning people in asshole areas with the cash transfer program. There were concerns, however, including how officers on ground ensure that the targeted population directly benefits from the fund. Muradi huu niendelea na wale ambao labda kwa sasa hivi kama wana maelezo basi nyie mwapatia maelezo hayo. Na kama hamutu wafikishia basi waende kwa county government pia wataelezo. And as the livestock continued dying, especially in northeastern parts of the country due to lack of pasture and water, the government reiterates that the situation is being contained as 450 million shillings has been set aside to cushion livestock owners under the livestock offtake program, among other interventions. The sector that are affected by drought are many, including livestock. And you might have seen you know, some of the images that have been carried in you know, uh, media of very, very emaciated looking livestock. And what the government has done is to buy the livestock from the farmers so that uh, it can be slaughtered for commercial purposes or slaughtered and given back to the farmers. Nixon Kisaka, K24 TV, Nairobi.